hey guys welcome back happy end of the normal monday through friday work week um so happy it's friday what a week it has been anyway i have some empties so i'm gonna start with sensi i'm just gonna do sensi and my regular wax together i just um that's what works for me but I will separate it out because I know that there are people that just come to watch Sensi and there are people that just like vendor wax and then there are those that love both. So I don't have a ton, but I have been working on bricks, making massive progress. And I also have another like a bin that I've started that have like half bars. So I'm hoping that um, next week, I will work through those, not forcing myself to. I'm melting them because I want to, um, but I'll just, ones that only have like ones or twos, I'll just, you know, use them up in smaller spaces in the boys' bathroom, the half bath, their bedrooms, that kind of stuff. Also, if you hear yelling, it is Friday. It's possible that they will be playing video games. I think some football games, something, I don't know, but everybody is fine. So, Sensei cotton cleanups. I was doing so well not using these. I was honestly um, hot dumping most everything. But, but I am finding that when I do that, I'm still having to use a cotton ball to go like on the inside and sometimes on the bottom because it will run a little bit. I put a cotton cleanup in and seriously, there's like no staining. Now I am a hundred percent just using the cotton cleanups upstairs, which I have quite a bit of warmers, but so that's where I'm using these. So I feel like I'm back on the cotton cleanup game. Um, I don't, and I won't pay for these, buy these full price. I, I just, I cannot justify, I can't. I can't, but I have a few packages and I think like going forward and stuff when I close parties out, that's how I'll get my hands on these. That was a lot for that. Um, finished up a bar in Blackberry Orange Marmalade. You guys, I love this. This was a bring back my bar from June. It's orange marmalade, blackberry jam over sugar crystals. And, oh my gosh, anything that says marmalade in it, I'm usually right in. And I love blackberry. I am hoping, but I don't want to go look again. I've edited my club. I really have to get that thing down to bare bones. I really do. I cannot keep everything that I like. And it's been so hard, but with like Christmas coming and it ships this month, I just have to like cross my fingers and hope that things come back. But this one, I am hoping that I kept it in, but I fear that I may have taken it out. I do have one more bar of it. When I tell you guys, I think I had four cubes left in here. I warmed this in my bedroom. Um, I have two warmers in there, an element warmer that's not Sensi. I think it was like from Target. And then I have a Yankee centerpiece warmer. Yeah, an element warmer. The little dish is teeny tiny. Um, this thing, three days. I, I'm not kidding. And when I say strong, it was so strong. Now, granted, um, I'm, I don't spend a ton of time in there. I'm, I'm, I'm at work all day. But when I come home and I like either change after work or whatever, this thing was so powerful. And I feel like the other times that I warmed it in my open concept... It wasn't crazy, crazy strong. This was so strong. Now, maybe because it has sat. I, I don't know. I have one bar left. I'm hoping that I didn't take it out, but I'm not going to worry about it. Okay. Best in Snow. I liked this a lot on cold, which I've had this for a long time. I don't even remember when this was last available. I've had this for a long time, and I always passed over it. I, I don't know why. But the last couple months, I was, like, sniffing it, 
I'm like, wow, that really does smell good. I need to get to warming it. It's evergreen, cool mint, and icy air. And it smells so icy and minty on cold. This was not a powerhouse, and I was surprised because it smelled like it was going to be really, really powerful. It's not available anyway, but I was a little disappointed. St. Nick Rodoodle. I, this is out of stock. I did put it in my club, um, so I'm good there. This smells so much better when you're warming it. Oh my gosh. Baked apples, spices, and a dusting of powdered sugar. I warmed this at, at work. My boss, my coworkers, even the principal had come in, and the AP had come in and commented how good this smells. <laughs> You guys, it's so cozy and inviting and warm. Um, yeah, I really like this. I'm going to try this one. I think I've warmed it upstairs, but I don't think I've had it going all downstairs. I've heard people say that it really smells like that powdered sugar. I didn't get that when I was warming it at work. Granted, I have one warmer. Um, so I'm going to see, but I, I really like that. I really do. Black Forest Pine. Another one that I love. This was a good one. Um, this was the scent of the month last December. So December of 2021. It's fir balsam, pepper tangerine, and smoked vanilla. Yeah. This is great. And um, I'm trying to remember. Where did I warm this? Oh, I just think over a period of time since the tree has been up in the room that the tree is in because we have an artificial tree. We did try the whole real tree thing the first couple years. We lived in Arizona, but this is really good. Strong, long lasting. I'm sure I have more bars of it. And the last bar um, that I went through was the Rugby All Blacks um, bar, which is not available. I thought these were sticking around. I don't know. It's citrus, cool mint, and fur balsam, all scents in which I love. This mix together was very, very strong for me. Um, that I didn't want this, like, downstairs everywhere. So this I warmed in the boys' bedrooms. And you guys, <laughs> I have teenagers. This was some powerful stuff. Very, very powerful. Um, I'm definitely glad that we tried it. I have another, the Wallabies Scentsy Bar. I mean, rugby one that I'll be testing out. I mean, testing out? No, I'll be warming it um, next week for sure. Pods in Farm Stand Pumpkin. This thing, these lasted. Now, this was not like a crazy, crazy strong scent. It was pretty powerful though. When, when I was in that vicinity, it's kind of like near where my um, refrigerator is and my pantry. And whenever I walked by, I was like, ooh, what is that? This was there for a long time. Um, it's apple, cinnamon stick, and pumpkin caramel. Pumpkin. Not necessarily, I don't get caramel. I'm not the biggest fan of it. Cinnamon sticks, yeah, I mean, I picked up a spice. I liked this, and for how long this lasted, I would definitely get that again. Um, okay, so that is it for Sunday. Like I said, I am really focusing on finishing up bricks that I have, you know, partials and stuff like that and bringing in and trying um, some newer bricks to me, ones that I have not <laughs> warmed at all since I got them. So that's it. Thank you if you were just here to see what I went through in Sunday. I hope you have an amazing weekend. Okay, a couple candles from Hallmarks. I went through Birchwood Vanilla. I think I purchased purchased this last year, or it might even have been the year before. I don't know. I don't know how to read these dang numbers on the bottom if Hallmarks does that and it tells you the year. Nope. Um, although, you know what? It does say 2107.15. So maybe that means July 15th of 21. I don't know. But at any rate... I liked this. I did not love it. The fragrance notes are birchwood, vanilla musk, winter jasmine, and cedarwood. 
I wanted so much more of that birch wood and the cedar wood. And I feel like I really got that vanilla musk. Um, but it did a really great job. Yes, there is a little bit right there. I think that is from holding the lighter, trying to get it to light. Um, but it did really well. I did not trim the wicks. And when I would burn this, I would let it go anywhere from like two and a half to four hours. I think four hours was my max. This was sweeter, sweeter than I wanted it to be. Um, happy to have tried it enjoyed it, but it wasn't a favorite. There's so many other Hallmarks candles that I absolutely love. Bath and Body Works. So, this I definitely bought last year. I think in the fall. And I just never got around to warming it. Burning it. It's Merry Mandolin Cookie. Baked Mandolin Cookies. Spiced almond, sweet orange, toasted coconut. So, I burned this. Well, you can see. So, it was pretty, you know, I don't know where Bath and Body Works pores tilt. We'll say, like, to here. Um, I burned it a couple times. You guys, the only time I could smell this candle is when I went to go blow it out. And I got, like, a major whiff of um, orange. That was it still smelling this now and I'm just getting orange um and I guess I kind of didn't mind but that's you know that I, I mean I don't want to say that I hate the fact that we spend money on a candle and I, I couldn't smell anything when it was actually burning it was basically there for ambiance well then I might as well just get an unscented candle right way cheaper no name brand if I want it there then I would blow it out and I could smell it so I did it two or three times. I thought, okay, maybe it's kind of like slow to start. Now, um, I ended up putting it on my candle warmer and it did fantastic to the point that one of the nights, cause I had it on my island, uh, my oldest son was eating dinner and he asked me if I could unplug it because he felt like he could taste it while he was eating dinner. That it was interfering with the taste of dinner. So, you know what? I guess when it comes down to it, I don't mind putting things on the candle warmer. Um, it's better for the paint in my house, for not having soot, for not having to babysit it. Just put it on and you really don't have to worry about it. But it's upsetting to think that somebody, because I'm sure that there are people that pay full price for a candle, that somebody spent $24.50 buying this and then not really smelling anything. But like I said, on that warmer, oh my gosh, the orange, the almond, like bakery notes. So um, I wouldn't repurchase this though. I didn't even, I don't know if that was even back. Okay. We shall do some bags from the Beating Garden pumpkin cupcake ice cream. These were two like ice cream scoops. This was nice. Did it smell like ice cream? Not to me. It smelled like a pumpkin, like a little bit of spice cupcake. It was good. Death becomes her. I've had this before, before, before in clamshells. It's um, spun sugar buttercream. Pink sugar, peppermint, oh, peppermint cookies, and rock candy. I mostly get the rock candy. This is so, 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 so sweet to me that this was a sample. So I just put this in my laundry room, and it, it's just a very sweet candy scent. That's what I get. Um, I would love to know if other people warmed this and you actually get the peppermint. From the pharmacist's daughter, this was Coffee Express. This had like my, her coffee blends that I picked up um, in her last pre-order that I have. Um, we're like making my mouth water. They smelled so good. So this was espresso, cinnamon sugar donuts, pumpkin pecan waffles, and coconut cream pie. I loved this. Um, I had a little bit left. I showed this, I think last week in an un like as part of my unempty so I had a little bit left enough for like two warmers and then I started on another coffee um I don't know if it was the camping one 
so good. She, I really do love her coffee. All three waxy wonders. This was adipose, don't cross streams, and pie crust. You got that adipose. This is good. Um, this was, I warmed this on a day that I didn't want a very, like, fragrance heavy, um, scent. I had enough for my downstairs warmers, and that's what I did. It did fine. I like all the things in here. Um, I wouldn't say that I really could smell pie crust, though. Cabin in the Woods. This is Malo Fireside Earl Grey Tea and Vanilla Buttercream. This was so strong. I have, like, plus, plus strong. Um, I like this. I like every scent note in here, and I think that it's... Um, I thought it was a little odd to have a tea with the Malo Fireside, but, I mean, you know, maybe you're sitting inside by the fireplace drinking some tea and eating, like, a nice bakery thing. Cupcake. This was good. Um, I would get this, like, in a larger situation, you know, next year. Uh, Moroccan cashmere, another sample. I warmed this in my half bathroom. Just that cashmere scent mixed with something else. It was nice. Um, this was a good, I would say like 24 hours in that warmer. Oh my gosh, this was good. This is from Pink Zebra from Tiffany. Um, smoked bourbon, aged oak, smoky sage, and orange bitters. You got like that, that oaky, that oaky note with orange bitters. I love, love the smell of bitters. Yeah, this was really good. Loved that. I will have more of like pink zebra because I did order some stuff. So you'll start to see some of that, um, in my empties. Sassy Girl Aroma, Yabba Dabba do. This I received in uh, May. Uh, Fruity Pebbles, Blackberry, and Whipped Cream. So um, this is the only one in her squeezable. I don't even think she's making these. I only bought one. And yes, definitely Fruity Pebbles. I did not smell any Blackberry. Um, this was straight up Fruity Pebbles. It, this I had all throughout the downstairs. And I came upstairs to like fold laundry or something. And when I went back downstairs, it was several hours later. This was like coming up the stairs. This, this is the second time I warmed this. I absolutely cannot stand. Um, I thought this was going to be like fun, like a fun way. No, it was more, it was annoying. It was annoying. Um, trying to get this out, squeeze it and all that stuff. Um, but it did smell good. If you are a fan of Fruity Pebbles cereal, yabba dabba do. But I wouldn't, and maybe other people didn't really like this, um, packaging. So I'll stick to her brittles. Love them. Rose Girl Swamps. This is from last year's Mario. Um, it's pine, peppermint, sugar cookie dough, and campfire marshmallow. I feel like I didn't pick, did I pick this up again this year? I feel like maybe I did not. I love this. Maybe I did. You guys, I can't keep things straight anymore. But this was not, um, this was not from this year. This was so good. I know this was a big hit this year. I think it probably is every year, but I feel like the videos that I watched of people hauling, it seems like everybody picked this up. So really good. Love, love, love Rose Girls. Oh my gosh. A love, a favorite. This is divine, magnificent, marvelous, all the positive things. This is a cranberry marmalade carbs. Oh my gosh. So last year was it or the year before she had cranberry marmalade opposite of keto. So, um, this was fantastic. So the carbs is the cookies, donuts, and bread, the cranberry marmalade. My gosh, anything marmalade, sign me up. It has like a little tiny bit of like spice, not a scary kind of cinnamon stick spice. Oh my gosh, this is so good. Yep, finished up a whole entire bag. I could not get enough of this. I'm so glad that I have more because I'd be so sad. Um, I absolutely love that. That is a favorite, favorite, favorite from Rose Girls. Um, from L3 Waxy Wonders in their scoop of all. This was Sweet Lavender, Peppermint, and Boardwalk 
mallow clouds. Strong, strong peppermint is what I wrote with a whole bunch of stars. Oh my goodness gracious. This I have been warming on and off um, in my bathroom. So it's taken me a long time to get through it because when I put it in, it lasts for days, which I'm not complaining about. I love that when that happens with the scent. Oh my gosh, so dang good. Heaviest on the peppermint followed by her sweet lavender. I don't know that I get Boardwalk Mallow Clouds. I'm sure it does something. Maybe like softens the lavender or something, but fantastic. Definite repurchase. Um, one that I'm working on, but haven't quite finished, but it'll be finished within the next day or two. Another scoop of all the burrow. I love this. I've had this in loaf scoops. I love it. Um, it's fresh baked cinnamon rolls with extra brown sugar and vanilla frosting. It's amazing. Delicious. It smells like fattening, fattening bakery. <laughs> so good. This is fantastic in the morning. Like if you want, if you're not interested in warming like a coffee scent, so good. And then I love this at night too, like after dinner. This is really great. Actually, I might finish this one up in my bedroom. I love bakery scents in the bedroom. One from, one from Goose Creek. This is Strawberry Jam, which is really good, which I have been warming with. And I think I have more up here. Um, I didn't finish the one that I started. Is her, I think it's called Fresh Baked Bread. I think that's all that it is. And I'm pretty sure I have some more coming. Um, but this is just, this is so fantastic. Um, Canada Cam and Ramona actually both talked about this like years ago. It's, this is so good. It's fantastic by itself. Great mixing it with things. And it's absolutely wonderful with that bread. Um, clam. So really good. So I have a little bit more of the bread. One left. That's why it's not in my empties. From K, Tinsel and Twinkle. Again, this one's from last year. I did pick up another one in her, uh, oh my gosh, Friday. What is that called? You guys know what I'm talking about. Anyway, when she had the sale on her clams, I'm sorry, my brain. I have a lot going on at work currently. Um, <laughs> oh, Black Friday. Jeez Louise. Okay. Tinsel and Twinkle. I love this. Been buying this for a long time. Orange zest, grapefruit, cinnamon, clove bud, cedarwood, sandalwood, and fir needles. I've said it before. It's a fantastic. Love it. Looking forward to warming my other clam. Why only picks up one? Well, because I have enough wax. Pink Bean Noel. So think of Vanilla Bean Noel, but with pink sugar instead. And that's what this is. This is from Up the Creek Scents. This was a sample. I love her labels. This was good. I've had it before. Um, does Her stuff does really well in my house. From K. Oh my gosh, you guys. This is at the bottom of my bin. This is pink evergreen. This is strong. This is beautiful. A tree scent that's not just tree tree. It's like a pink sugary tree. Okay. I'm going to show you the date on this. Cure two weeks from September 14th, 2019. This was amazing. So I finished this. I probably had like half of this. So I cut the half in half and I warmed this in my half bathroom. And this was in there for a few days, you guys. Yes. I had half of a clan of a sunshot cop tucked away for all this time. Loved this. I don't even know if Kay even offers this anymore, but I know at one point I had a lot of these. That is it. And the last thing that I warmed, Handworks Winter Candy Apple, the Bath and Bath Body Works tape. Oh, I think just to prove to myself that I do, I really don't like this. It's um, apples, pears, and like a candied orange. Yeah, I see why it's called candied 
winter candy apple. This is so dang, ugh, like sickening sweet. I don't like this. I don't. I know I've had the candle like years ago. Not a favorite. This thing was a freaking powerhouse. I warmed this in multiple warmers um, in my open concept, like putting like one cube in a warmer. Oh my gosh. So, 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 so strong. You could, I, when I opened my front door, I could smell this. So, just needed a little, I guess, proof that it wasn't a love, and it definitely is not. But if you want a strong scent, I guess Winter Candy Apple is very strong. So, that is it. I didn't mean for this to be this long. I'm so glad I didn't bring up, like, all my unempties. But I hope that, I'm sorry you hear yelling now, because I can definitely hear it, and I'm behind a closed door. Um... I may do a couple more videos. I'll try to space them out and not upload them all. Um, I'll see. Just because I have a very busy weekend and I don't want boxes and stuff sitting. Drives me a little nuts. So that's it, you guys. I hope everybody is doing well. If you celebrate the holidays, are you feeling ready to go home? I mean, do you stay home? Do you go away? Do you have a house full of people? I would love to know. What have you been warming? Um, are you still buying wax? Or have you put a little halt on it until after the holidays? That's it, you guys. Take care, and I'll see you guys in my next one.